Well, all right. Another interesting signing here as the Miami Dolphins go out and get Kendall Fuller. Kendall Fuller, who was kind of talked about as maybe the key free agent. Now, I'm a little confused. that So it says two years at $16.5 million. I'm assuming that's total uh, money, not per, uh, you know, per year. So even if it's per year, I don't honestly take that. Uh, but if it's uh, total, that feels like a massive steal for a guy who's a really good corner, a really, uh, you know, well, a, a guy who's been a really good player for quite some time and has, you know, coming off of several good seasons in Washington. And even last year, he was one of the guys still playing well, despite the kind of chaos surrounding him. So for Miami, who, you know, uh, probably could use a corner, right? The Xavier Howard thing, they thought maybe, you know, it just kind of, you know, I don't know what happened to him, but it wasn't working out. Uh, I still think Ramsey's very good. I thought he played well once he came back from the injury. Obviously, uh, you want to, you know, get a full season of him could be helpful. And, you know, uh, Kater Koh, who I like as a slot guy. So if this works, they have Jordan Poyer, Javon Holland. All of a sudden, this could be a, like actually like kind of loaded defense, especially if they get their edge rushers healthy again with Bradley Chubb and Jalen Phillips. I mean, I know they lost Wilkins, so the interior defensive line needs some work and maybe the linebacking core as well, but you can kind of live with that if you can get the other stuff. So here I go falling in love with Miami again, right? This is, I feel like I always, uh, and this is, you know, last year I was very high on them. I got burned, but these are smart moves. And I feel like Miami is making some smart decisions, uh, you know, these past couple of years at this point. Uh, I, I do think Fuller is a real underrated player. And I'm really surprised that more cornerback needy teams didn't go out and make an effort to sign him. This is something that would have made sense to me. So, uh, yeah. I'm a big fan of this move from Miami's perspective. I think they did a you know good job. Uh, what do you think? Let me know in the comments below. Always love hearing from y'all. And of course, as always, thanks for watching.